great big things like that happen. That you know, nobody really knew if it could happen or not. No. No, no really. Could I ask Kurt, yes. who is my son, how he got started with monkey fish? How did you get started with monkey fish? Well, it was uh, an ad way back in the comic strip that were called the sea monkeys. Uh, yeah. They were uh, they were actually brine shrimp. Brine shrimp. Brine shrimp. It was a comic book in a in a comic strip. It was uh, for kids, boy, for little kids. And when I got them, that I thought they were going to be like the drawings, but no, they were brine shrimp. <laughs> <laughs> My husband was a scientist and had microscopes so, so he could show Kurt what he was looking at, and then we went to a lake where they were everywhere, and that that's what started him on these monkey fish, or sea monkeys, and they do everything. I mean, they're, it, he developed this whole story just from that one ad. Right. I redrew them, and then I named them the monkey fish. So what is, I asked this to Jill too, what is your biggest challenge, Kurt? When you're drawing and making art, what is your biggest challenge? To make uh, famous. To make them famous? No, or to me. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, and, um, well, you are, because you've been in the paper, and you've been here now a couple of times. Yes. Um, so, why is it important to be famous? To get myself in the paper and stuff like that. And, and um, uh, why is that, why is it important to be in the paper? To make myself famous. Okay. okay. So, um, so I think you're halfway there because you have been in the paper and you've been in the Africa. You're here now for at least the second time talking to an audience. So that's, uh, I think you're halfway there. Uh, Jill, I have a feeling that's not your, your goal. Well, I think every artist wants to show their work. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, so showing is important, yeah. especially with your work, because you need that interaction. Right. And I, I'm a person or artist that um, I like to collaborate with others. Um, so I think that's one of the challenges about being in Corvallis. <laughs> I think. Um, and also about moving around, you know, I've moved around quite a bit, so I need, um, yeah, I need collaborators, and I enjoy working like that. What, what makes it so attractive to collaborate? Well, I think, um, I think it makes the work richer, um, I, I think it makes it, I mean, I, I come from, you know, an interdisciplinary place where that happens. Um, so I, I really like, you know, cinema and art. I like that relationship. Um, and then I like larger projects. I like projects that um, come from multiple places, people from multiple places. So Desert Notes, um, it takes place in Nevada. I'm in Oregon. There's um, two artists that are um, on the East Coast. So, bringing artists together in do you a different environment. Do you actually physically meet, or do mm -hmm. you meet? Uh, uh we we have done one uh, week in the desert together, and.